All right then. Welcome all. We're just going to start up Mozilla here and go up to uh, the um, Internet Archive. Welcome to Killer Crayon. Now, before I begin, this is basically an old, very old, like, you know, Tron-like game. Where the idea is that basically you're like, you know, a killer crayon trying to kill all the other crayons in a box, so to speak. As you can basically see, this is like made in like 1992. But what's especially very special about this game here? I want to know that this is basically a game that you can basically play on your like, you know, screensaver. Basically, like, you know, if you basically like, you know, um, set like your old screensaver back in the day, you could have like, you know, this game basically like, you know, playing in the background where like, you know, you see like this like, you know, um, Little, like you know crayons like you know going everywhere basically just to, like you know try and like you know wipe each other out or like you know do whatever they can and you got you can even like start playing the game in the screen save if you basically want to very simply by like you know press like f2 for a new game but anyhow recently um i basically saw like you know trying like game being like shown by like another youtuber i was like you know i really want to basically show this off at some point for myself so we're just going to jump into uh this very old game and play it for a little bit. So yes, DOS box launching emulator, very old game, requires an emulator base to play. Now don't bother you basically control like you know the arrow keys. And the um the AI is like, you know, not too smart, so you can usually like, you know, wipe them out pretty fast. Now, I'm not by, by, basically about this game here. The idea is that basically is trying to go as far as possible without like, you know, not dying. And what's more basically about this game here as well, and what Yell just wiped himself out there, because that happens. Um, basically, this is a game that like, you know, uh, it gets progressively tougher, and so blue apparently. Basically, like, the, the, the crayons will get smarter as you go along here. They won't like necessarily try and kill themselves. Like, these guys basically are like very, like, newbie-friendly, like, you know, Creons for us, basically, fights, so that's fine. And there goes Blue, because, you know, idiots are idiots. Now, don't bother ask, like, you, like, you know, like, you keep fighting these guys, you'll basically like, go up in, like, levels after, like, you know, you basically like, beat best, like, you know, four of them at once, more or less, these, like, Creons, so... Whoop. I don't like the fact that they're coming over here, these guys. Hopefully they'll kill each other. There goes green. There goes yellow. I should have sort of boxed myself in, but it doesn't really matter. I'm not that big part of this game that's like you're just trying to, like, you know, not box yourself in. Now, no, by the way, I'm actually fast in blue here, but eventually the concurrents do get faster than you, and then, like, you know, it becomes more of an issue basically to stop them. Oop, I killed myself. Oh, I can also go backwards if you want, want to start. Because, you know, Odeon lets you do so. And Blue has killed himself. Okay. Bye-bye, Blue. I'm not the main thing about these games, by the way, is that usually, like, you know, your biggest oscillator is yourself. It's like, you know, killing yourself, but whatever. Oh, I died. And there goes yellow, because, you know, AI is going to AI. Now, no problem that their colors basically go away as, like, you kill them. So, um, you know, basically, like, you know, the thing is that, you know, eventually they're going to, like, you know, wipe themselves out. Up oh, there goes blue. And then, like, you know, as, like, they wipe themselves out, you have, you have more room basically to do whatever you want to. That's not what I very, very much like about this game, because basically, like, you know, it, like, gives you room to basically keep playing if, like, you know... You're playing against like the CPUs and like they're like you know battling it out. Up oh, there goes blue. And there's like you know level two here. Let's just do that. You can box himself in. The yellow's gone. We're just up to blue here. Well, that's perfect. We can just cut this guy off. 
Now we're on level 3. Whoops, I killed myself. That's not going to kill him because he's basically going to loop himself out, but whatever. Up oh, there you go. Most of the time these guys should find a race going to kill themselves, but you know. Alright, so he's got that space base to work with. I've got the rest of the space to work with. There's blue. And why not? They're going to kill themselves right there. Not that their name space changes to go along here. So it's like you, know, you have different like curious and you basically killings you go along because you're basically a serial killer. A serial uh, Krigon killer is what you basically are. And there we go, level 4. Now against Sky. And I note that like, this guy's going a lot faster now, so they do speed up as they go along. That's what makes these guys difficult as you go along, but still get like, you know, faster and faster and faster and faster. Whoop. There goes yellow. Yeah, you can see how fast like purple is basically or pink was basically catching up with me there, so they will catch up to you pretty fast if you're not careful. Whoops, I died. I know the controls are pretty good. But Oh, I don't like this, he's going a little faster than me. There we go. I'm not basically like, you know, oh, the controls are okay, but I mean, it, basically when you know, like you play this like in the olden times, it was like you know a lot better because basically like, you know the cranes weren't as like necessarily as fast as you, or I mean, not fast as you, but basically controls were a lot better basically like, you know back in the day. So, um, you basically like, get like, uh, like a lot better like you know fire basically because like the controls were like you know, more like you know crisp, but you know, whatever. Here's the demo, by the way. The um, here's it playing itself, by the way. So this would be see what you basically see on the screen server. You basically see like you know, ram like Kranz is going against against each other like this, and like you know, up oh, well, Res did kill himself there. Let's see how well the computer does before like it conks out. Yep, there it goes. As you can see, the AI is not not necessarily the smartest thing. It'll basically try to like not loop itself into a corner, but you know, it will unfortunately. Oh, that's the wrong way for Red to go. He might still win, though. Nope, he's died. I always like to like bet like the demo. How far can it go? Can it get up to three colors? Can it get up to four colors before it wipes out itself out? Well, it's going to wipe itself right here. One more crane left for him. And by the way, you can press escape. Basically, like, you know, when you're basically, like, you know, um, you're basically playing this game, you press F2, you basically play it in the screensaver. But if you're basically, like, you know, we're playing at the game itself, because it was actually, like, you know, it's only, like, executable, you can play the game itself and, like, you know, see how far you can basically go. And I'll just play a little bit more here, so basically, see how far I can basically get, like, this time around. Notice probably I'm going a little bit slower here. I'm not basically, like, it starts out, you're fairly slow, but it, it speeds up as you go along. It was blue. So 1994. That's my score. Oh, there was blue.
Look at himself soon enough. Yeah, this is it's a winning game at this point. There we go. I'm not sure how basically the score is calculated. But I think it's basically calculated like you know, um, the faster basically maybe kill him, the more score you basically get. You didn't fall for that, that guy, unfortunately, but oh well. All right, blue's done. There we go. You know, it goes to show, like, you know, Tron is just such a popular concept. You can do so much with it. I don't like this too much, but whatever. Let's go this way. Oh, good, they're trapped. The pink and blue are done for. There goes pink. Now, don't bother, as, like, the, you know, it tears around. They will eventually like, be able to free themselves if you're not careful, so... You have to watch out for that, but whatever. Oh, he killed himself anyways. Oops, I killed myself. Who's faster, me or him? It looks like we're running at the same speed for most part, so... I guess at level 2 base are more or less the same speed. Let's move that mouse cursor out of the way. And... Let's do this. Not the Christmas motion, but whatever kills him. I'll note by the way, as like a kid, I like would just play this like over and over and over again, just trying like to get a better score. Up oh, there goes pink. There goes that. You can still get out this guy, but whatever. Oh, I can't get out. He's going to kill himself. What the? I don't know how I died there, but you know. Bugs are like a thing like in these old games. Sometimes there's going to be bugs. You have to just deal with them. He didn't technically get out there, but you know, he failed to, so that's fine. There goes yellow. Oh, perfect. I can possibly kill this guy right here. There we go. Knocked him into the corner. I'm sort of like, you know, doing a little bit tight here, but whatever. When it's multiple occurrence on the screen, you have to do, make do right, so. There goes yellow. There goes blue. Sometimes it's all about surviving, by the way, so you just like survive as long as you can before like these guys basically catch up to you. There goes blue. Perfect, he killed himself right away like that. All right, there goes blue. Oh, good, they already killed himself, so... Just blue again. He can technically get out. And he did get out, so...
I'll just take it into a corner here and hope these guys die by themselves. There goes green. Pink should go next. There goes yellow. I don't know if I just box yourself in. Usually these guys just kill themselves by themselves, so. Whoop, he's going faster than me. There goes blue. There goes yellow. And yeah, I don't think it's certainly as fast as you go along here, so. They will get faster. Perfect, got them. And we're all the way up back up to level 5, and free crayons at left, so. God, he's fast, isn't he? I love the beauty of him being fast like this is that they like you know can't kill themselves a lot faster so oh let's kill it. good there we go That's a good thing about it. As you get like to these little higher levels, basically they go so fast that you know the games are like real fast. So this kills them so fast, basically it's the way for me to die, so to speak. Sometimes. Holy crap! Does he move fast now? Pretty much just waiting for, you know, hopefully they don't kill you now, because they're going so fast, but whatever. Oh, I died again. Game over. Alright, so that's basically Killer Cran. Basically, you, uh, you go as far as you basically can, without, like, you know, dying to, like, the other Killer Crans and killing as many as you possibly can in the future. And that's basically a game I play as, like, you know, in my youth, like, you know, just trying to get as far as possible, and I play quite a bit, but whatever. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and take care.